It's October 2023 and I see my friend hitting a muscle up. So me and my other friend are looking at him like flipping fangirls at a concert and he's hitting muscle ups for reps, clean and everything. So once he's finished his set of muscle ups, we go up to him and ask him how does he do it and he asks us, okay, can you do 10 pull ups? And me and my friend were thinking like, yeah, we can do 10 pull ups pretty easy. So he says, okay, I'll teach you the form. And within maybe a week, maybe a week and a half, you should be able to get it. So we practice. And in literally like an hour or two, my friend hits the muscle up easy. And I'm proud of him, but it should have been me right so I'm, I'm kind of annoyed so now I've got that like flipping anime motivation in my head I gotta hit a muscle up too I can't be left behind I don't want to be left out so I practice I go home I look at YouTube videos on how to hit a muscle up and I carry on trying and practicing for weeks I'm trying to do the swing bring it up to my knees and then but I can't get over the flipping bar and I keep on struggling for weeks and for whatever reason I just can't hit it so now my friends being able to hit it for like two reps or even three reps sometimes and I can't even hit one but I don't let that defeat me I carry on trying a few weeks pass by and my friend says let's go and try and hit a muscle up this is at the end of a workout he says let's go and try and hit a muscle up so we approach the pull up bar I stare at the pull up bar, it's my turn to hit a muscle up, so I do the motion that my older friend taught me, the three step process, and before I know it I'm literally at the top of the bar, it was literally like a flash, I didn't even recognise I was at the top of the bar, and I push up, and I go down, and I hit my first muscle up, <laughs> that is sick. Tutorials on how to hit a muscle up are good on YouTube, but there's some stuff I want to make clearer because there's some stuff in there which I found kind of vague. Before we get into that, my name's Alfie. I help young men transform their lives through self-improvement. If you're interested, hit the subscribe button in the description. Um, in the description. Hit the subscribe button below. It's a win-win for both of us. Okay, so the first thing is requirements. You need to be able to hit 10 pull-ups. 8 to 10 pull ups, preferably for sets. If you can do like 3 sets of 10 pull ups, you can easily hit a muscle up. You literally just need to learn the form. By the way, if you can't hit 8 to 10 pull ups, I'm going to teach you a pull up form which will help you get used to the motion which you're going to use for the muscle up anyway. So don't worry if you can't hit 8 to 10 pull ups. So, a 3 step process to hitting the muscle up the swing, the pull, and the push. And I'm going to go into detail on all three of these. If you can literally understand these three things, you got the good muscle up form you know what to do you, like you'll be able to hit your first muscle up literally after you watch this video if you can understand this three-step process first things first is the swing you want to get a slight swing when you're on the pull-up bar it, everyone on youtube's told you this already get a slight swing on the pull-up bar and they always and the key is to pull upwards once you feel that you're going backwards this is what's not explained well a lot of people you a lot of people try and make it super fancy and over complicated like you need the sweet spot of when you're falling backwards and then you can put no 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 this is how you know what the sweet spot is this is how you get a consistent sweet spot every single time you know back when you were a child when you're like three years old and you was on a swing in a park you knew when you were going backwards you didn't need to like look back to realize oh yeah i'm going backwards you just felt it right you felt the swing and you know when you were going backwards instinctively do that exact same thing when it comes to swinging on the pull-up bar just notice when you're going backwards once you feel like you're about to go backwards that's when you pull up so that's step one step two is the pull now there's the way to do this is once you've like once you feel that you're going backwards you want to pull up 
whilst also bringing your knees up to your chest as much as possible don't overthink like oh yeah i, I don't get my knees to it's not important right just bring your knees up to generate a bit of momentum and try and put like try and move around the bar i don't know how to explain it but it's like like it's almost like you're rowing that's the way i think of it it's almost like you're rowing if you don't understand that just ignore it you'll kind of get it the more you do it and this is the part where even if you can't hit eight to ten pull-ups this is what you should practice you should practice doing that form swinging bringing your knees up and moving around the bar and if you can do that eventually you'll be able to hit eight to ten reps and once you can do that you can probably attempt the muscle up and even if you don't hit eight to ten reps you could still try and do a cheeky muscle up every now and then like you know what i mean like there's no rules to this just just have fun step three is the push now if you've done the two first steps correctly this should literally be easy like you shouldn't even need to think about this because it'll just naturally happen your wrists because one problem that most people have when they do a muscle up is that their wrists just don't turn and the reason that happens is because you haven't got enough momentum or you haven't correctly went around the bar so if you do the swing and the pull correctly you can easily just flick your wrist over and then all you have to do is a straight bar dip and then you go back down simple as that don't worry this is one thing don't worry about not getting a clean form when you're first starting out that's like you know when you're on rocket league and you're trying to freestyle and you hit this awesome clip but then it bounces once and then you're angry with it don't be like one of them don't be one of them if you get if you end up doing this stuff don't worry about it bro it's fine your form will come over time the more you practice it every now and then you'll hit some clean ones you might chicken wing is what it is your form will come over time your strength will come over time and then you'll be able to hit it with clean form consistently so hopefully i've explained some things in this tutorial that other youtubers haven't really explained well because that was just one thing that annoyed me a lot of people would try and explain a muscle up and i must have watched like 10 videos and only then did i kind of understand so hopefully i've saved you a lot of time by just watching one video um yeah, hope it helps you.